So we have this ghost. Ooh. And we have a pumpkin. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> and then a witch. going to be just Carly and I because we want to share with you guys a whole bunch of stuff that we got for her upcoming Halloween party and I know the boys don't want nothing to do with this in fact I tried to get Chase to do like a co-ed party with her and invite some friends and he wants nothing to do with it so <laughs> this is going to be all Carly and tell him about your party <laughs> So my Halloween party is the day before Halloween. We're inviting about 11 to 12 people, and we really don't have a whole menu picked out. Not yet. We gotta work on that next. But some things that I'm thinking of are pretzels and teeth, a slushy machine, and the sherbet drink. Oh, like but we like, made at your birthday party yeah, like, where you add the ice cream and then the poppers the or something like pop. that? Yeah, orange pop. So for today's video, we actually partnered with Nestle Pure Life. And the reason why is because, uh, hello, they have the cutest little Halloween bottles. And these are perfect size because they're eight ounce. And they will so, be wasting water bottles like yeah, Blake does. Yeah, her brother has a habit of half drinking water bottles and, and then, then we find them. Tell them everywhere. where we find them, Carly. In his bedroom. Yeah. All over his bed. Like you'll walk in there, there's just like 10 lined up. Yeah. And they're all half drinking. So these water bottles come in three really cute designs. Which ones do you, do you have? The blue mummy. The mummy. And then there's the vampire. Or then I wondered if it was Dracula. I think it's Dracula or just like a vampire. No. And then there's a skull. It's a sugar skull. Sugar skull, I believe. So in their, these Nestle Pure Life water bottles, they actually have eight different designs and our package has three of them. So for our place settings, we're actually going to have these spiderweb plates and we got these big pumpkin bowls for like chips or whatever, but we got spiderweb <laughs> spider plates, chevron napkins, forks and spoons. So next to each place setting, we are going to have a water bottle for everyone to drink it through the night. And also, at the end of the party, we're going to have a goodie bag with some candy and a water bottle inside of it so everybody can stay hydrated on Halloween. Yeah, these are like the perfect portable size for Halloween night because number one, if you want, mom or dad could either put it in their pocket like if it's chilly where you live, like it usually is for us. If I have like a sweatshirt on, it'll fit in my pocket perfectly. Or um, the other thing, because if they're lightweight, the kids could just drop them in the bottom of their trick-or-treat bag and it'd be like no big deal. And they'll have water to, like Carly said, as they're munching on their candy, they'll have water to keep hydrated. And I also wanted to share that Nestle Pure Life did a survey called the ripple effect and you guys can click the link below to learn more about the survey because there's a lot of really cool facts on there about kids being dehydrated and stuff like that but they did a survey and one of the results was moms believed if you had water bottles with cute little labels on them like this kids would be more apt to be drinking the water so, what do you think i think because it's I think just the fact alone that it's a small eight ounce bottle makes it cute and it makes me want to drink it. But the little uh, Halloween decoration is definitely an added treat. And it's treat. good to pack in your lunch. Yep. Cause then you fit. don't have to waste the whole Yeah, that's lunch. true. If we have any left over, you'll be able to use these for your lunch. We have drinks covered and we told you we don't quite know all the menu items yet. So we'll probably share with you guys once it gets closer to the date what we decide is going to be on Question. the menu. Should have like a chocolate fountain that would be awesome <laughs> so, so chocolate fountain. some of the other stuff that we got um we got this like orange and black um little like curtain things. for the doorway that i figured when the kids come in from the garage we'll have it hanging because they'll have to come in to like use the bathroom and stuff <laughs> we'll have this what? hanging on the door so basically the whole party's going to be in the garage Probably, unless it's like really, really bad weather, then we might have it in the house. So we have some little tiny chocolates. At first I thought they were blueberries or beads or something. <laughs> and what we're going to do with those is we're going to put a bunch of those in uh, these clear dishes. And we 
got five of them. Green. Because we got green and black, and we're going to put them in these. And then along with that, we got some orange ones, too. They're just little candies. Did you get purple? We're going to put, like, um, no, we're going to put, like, say you have green, we might put the orange, like, rock candy, and you kind of just stick them in there. And then the black, we might do green. Yeah. If they're for whoever wants them. We got rock candy, and then I also got these, like, orange, like, I don't know, twist <laughs> swirl suckers. So I guess twisty pops they're called. So and then also there is a crystal shiny ball. It's kind of like a I don't know. yeah, it's an LED crystal ball. Um, we'll put that somewhere in the center Ow. of the room, and um, it'll put all these beautiful lights on the ceiling, which you can't really see now, but. I'm sure when we decorate, we'll make a video. Um, hopefully we'll be able to film some at her party. And also a little tiny like banner set with Happy Halloween, Boo, and Trick or Treat. So all kinds of different patterns. Yep, and then we got these orange, yellow, and white little hangy ball things. Oh, those are candy corn style. Oh yeah, kind of like candy corn. And then some just plain orange ones. Pumpkins. Those are cute. So, and then here behind us, Carly, do you want to grab those? I thought these were so cute. And they're actually pretty cheap. They were under $10. And I'll be able to reuse them too because we'll be able to use them when we decorate like the house next year. So we have this ghost. Ooh. And we have a pumpkin. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> and then a witch. Ooh. <laughs> So I don't know if we'll put these like on a table, maybe the food table somewhere. We just got basically a whole bunch of random stuff. So they're so cute. So are you planning on playing games at the party? Yes. Maybe a few board games and I might make up some games. No, I mean like Halloween games. Like oh. you're gonna bob for apples? <gasps> yeah. <laughs> or pin the nose on the witch. Blindfolded, remember? Spin around blindfolded. I'm so excited because I we have not had like a oh. Halloween party oh. since Ooh. Andrew pin was in kindergarten. Pin the broom on the witch. <laughs> <laughs> Let us know in the comments below if you guys want us to share with you like the whole process, our party planning process. We're going to plan some games and like I said, food and stuff too. I'm probably going to get on Pinterest and come up with some really cool treat ideas. Thank you to Nestle Pure Life for sponsoring us to do the video. So thank you very much. And don't so, forget your water bottles this Halloween. Yeah. Um, so, this case we have here has 24 bottles in a case. So one for each day. <laughs> day what? Day. <laughs> <laughs> so bye. Uh, that's it for today. Please subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching. Please thumbs up this video. Thumbs it up. The question of the day is what is your favorite part about Halloween? Good question. What's your favorite part? <laughs> Getting candy. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm thinking I might actually dress up for your Halloween party. When I was at the store buying stuff, I seen some pretty cool costumes for adults. Oh my. <laughs> I'll try not to embarrass you too badly. Alright guys, thanks for watching our video. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye! Bye!